Now the first of our longer questions here, we've got, we've got three ducks to think about. A red duck, a green duck and a blue duck. The first bit of information here we have is that the area of the base of the green duck is four times larger than the area of the base of the blue duck, so we can draw that to represent that. And given they all have the same uh, shape, that must mean that the volume of the blue duck can fit into the green duck eight times. So eight times the volume of the blue duck equals one green duck. Since the density of these ducts is all constant, we can say that the mass is directly proportional to the volume. Therefore, the mass of the green duct is eight times the mass of the blue duct. So that's 24 grams. Now let's move on to think about the red duct. So we know the blue duct Let's say that has a side length of 1, the green duck therefore has a side length of 2, and the red duck, which is equivalent in length to the blue duck added to the green duck, must have a side length of 3. So we can work out that the mass of that red duck must be equal to the mass of a blue duck multiplied by 3 cubed. It's three times bigger in every dimension, so it's got to be three cubed, which gives us a mass of 81 grams. Now for the second part of this question, we need to work out the density of the ducts. We know that the water that is displaced has a mass of 32 grams, so if we can use that to work out the volume of water displaced, that will allow us to work out the volume of the ducts. We already know the mass of the ducts, and so it should be a doddle. So the volume of the water displaced, first of all, volume equals mass divided by density. Mass here is 32 times 10 to the minus 3 grams. We're looking at uh, the green duct, remember, divided by 10 to the power of 3, which is the density of water. That gives us 32 times 10 to the power of minus 6 metres cubed. That is the volume of the water that is displaced, so therefore that is also the volume of the green duck. Now we can do the same thing in reverse, using density equals mass divided by volume. We already know the mass of the duck, which is 24 grams, so 24 times 10 to the minus 3 kilograms. Divide that by 32 times 10 to the minus 6 cubic metres, which is our volume. So this gives us an answer of 24 over 36, 32 times 10 to the power of positive 3, or 750 kilograms per meter cubed.